Jay Quellen. Balake. D Nice. A A Ron. It's pronounced Aaron. Insubordinate and churlish. Okay, students, settle down. Settle down. That includes you, Mr. Rodriguez. Do you want to take the milk carton off of your head? Thank you so much. We have a special guest today. He's from this neighborhood, and he's a former gang member. And he's come here this morning to talk to you about life choices. So please give a warm Central High School welcome to Donnie Herrera. I used to be just like you. Just like you, 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 you. Used to clown around. Make fun of the principal. Put milk on my head, just like you, Rodriguez. <laughs> and then, I got hit with AIDS. Consequences. Got into some real trouble, boy. Stole from my mom and dad. Stole from my own sister. And then one day, a piano fell on my head. What? Consequences. I feel like you missed a step there. Gave me 88 concussions, one for each key. You think I'm learning, but no. See, I'm just like you. I got back out there, started making some real crimes. Home, boy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And then I got trampled by a herd of buffalo. What? Consequences. OK, Donny, um, I think we've had enough. I'm done with my story. I was like you. I decided it'd be cool to hang out with some of the tough kids. Mm. You know who I'm talking about. They were hanging on the streets late at night. More than cigarette smokers' homes. And then, one day, I got shot out of a catapult. That's it. Okay. Into the mouth of a dragon! Students, everything you've heard here today is a lie. I don't lie anymore. You're all excused. Look at me! I shouldn't even be here! Thank you, Arilio. I apologize, Therese. So I got really deep in the crimes. I did a drive-by at my own daughter's quinceanera. Yeah! Shot up everybody, dead, killed! Yeah! Yeah! Then I got sucked into a wormhole. Consequences? That's it, okay. Everybody go. That's I was it. in another dimension! Tried to introduce my own parents to each other. Almost failed. Arm was disappearing. I invented Johnny B. Good at my parents' prom, and at the last moment they kissed and it came back. The faster we get away from him, the better. No, nobody believed me! Where's my crack? Where's my crack? Oh, oh. Consequences! All right, listen up, y'all. I'm y'all substitute teacher, Mr. Garvey. I taught school for 20 years in the inner city, so don't even think about messing with me. Y'all feel me? Mm -hmm. OK, let's take a roll here. Jay Quellen. Where's Jay Quellen at? No Jay Quellen here? <clears throat> yeah. Uh, do you mean Jacqueline? OK, so that's how it's going to be. Y'all want to play. OK, then. I've got my eye on you, Jay Quellen. Balake. Where is Balake at? There's no Balake here today. Yes, sir. My name is Blake. Are you out of your goddamn mind? Blake. What? Do you want to go to war, Balake? No. Because we could go to war. No. I'm for real. I'm for real. So you better check yourself. D nice. Is there a D nice? 
if one of y'all says some silly ass name, this whole class is gonna feel my wrath. Now, D nice. Do you mean Denise? Son of a bitch! You say your name right, right now. Denise? Say it right. Denise. Correctly. Denise. Right. Denise. Right. D nice. That's better. <sighs> Thank you. Now, A.A. Ron, where are you? Where is A.A. Ron right now? No A.A. Ron, huh? Well, you better be sick, dead, or mute, A.A. Ron. Here. Oh, man. Why didn't you answer me the first time I said it, huh? Huh? I'm just, you know, I'm just asking, you know, I said it like four times, so why didn't you say it the first time I said A.A. Ron? Because it's pronounced Aaron. Son of a bitch! You done messed up, A.A. Ron! Now take your ass on down to Oshag Hennessy's office right now and tell him exactly what you did. Who? Oshag Hennessy! Principal O'Shaughnessy? Get out of my goddamn classroom before I break my foot off in your ass! Insubordinate and churlish. Timothy. Present. Thank you. I'm right, gonna take a little roll here. Jay Quellen. Here. You are present. Balake. I hear. Uh huh. D Nice. Here. Good. Jessica. Thank you. Mr. Garvey. What is it, A. A. Ron? Some of us need to leave uh, a few minutes early today. Oh. Oh, is that so? Mm-hmm. And what, pray tell, is the reason for this premature exodus? Your book photos. Yeah, um, we have to leave 15 minutes early to meet up with our clubs. <laughs> All right, you know what? That might work with other substitute teachers. But I taught in the inner city for over 20 years. Now y'all wanna leave my class early so y'all can go meet up at the club. Ain't none of y'all old enough to go to the damn club! Ridiculous. Mr. Garvey. God, son of a bitch! Did I stutter? Just then? Yes. I'm gonna throw you out the goddamn window. What, Jay Quillen? Mr. Garvey, we're, we're telling the truth. We, we have clubs at this school. We have clubs for special interests. Okay, I see. So y'all wanna play. Y'all wanna play. Yeah, okay, we're gonna play little games. Fine, I'll play. I'm more than happy to play some games with y'all. Anyone who's in a club, stand your ass up. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, there it is. There it is, the usual suspects. What the hell club are you in, Jay Quillen? Future Leaders of America. Okay, okay. How would you know if you're gonna be a leader in the future? Is there a stargate in your bedroom? Can you travel through time, Jay Quillen? No. Then sit the flip down. Balake, I, here's the thing, I don't even know why I'm about to ask you this. Balake. What club are you in? Uh, I'm part of the Spanish club. Sp this, you about as Spanish as Rion Seacrest, with your big ass fraggle rock hair. How about you, D Nice? I'm in the chess club. Uh, I'm sorry, sweetheart. Y you are not in the chess club. The mosquito bite club, maybe. Oh, it's hurtful. Truthful. There he is. A. A. Ron. Hey. What club are you in? I'm the president of the Glee Club. Why do I talk? The Glee Club! <laughs> like they gonna have a club dedicated to a TV show. Take your ass to O'Shag Hennessy's office right now before I bust a club up in your butt. Okay. Go! Okay, I'm gonna go. Mischievous and deceitful, chicanerous and deplorable. This is Principal O'Shaughnessy. Students, please report to the gymnasium for your club photos. Fake announcement. Now, does anybody in here have a valid reason for leaving this classroom? Timothy. 
I gotta go pick up my daughter. Yo, excuse me. This is Brown. is like the most lesbo teacher I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> you know what I mean? Why you reading, bitch? Because I like to read, and this is a really good book. You're a really good bitch, bitch. Why you gotta bother me, man? Because I'm not doing very well at school. I'm reading at a third grade level. I really don't want to get left back. So when I see somebody reading for fun, it makes me feel that much more stupid. And then I get mad. Uh, um, I didn't know that. I, thanks so much for opening up to me. Shut up, queer. I understand. Why, I mean, why you got to go there? I've been having sexual fantasies about some of the other guys at school. What? Give me that. I'm afraid of these feelings and what they might mean. It's like because I hate myself so much, I gotta point that hate outward towards you. Okay. <laughs> I, you understand this on such a deep level that you, I don't oh, understand. Oh, oh. <laughs> now I'm gonna punish you physically for acknowledging my emotional problems. Wait, 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 wait. I, I was gonna say if you understand yourself so well, then maybe you should try working on changing it. Of course I wanna change it but it's the only defense mechanism I have against deeper, more terrifying problems buried inside of me. You're lucky my dad's here. Get the damn truck, son. I need to take you home and beat on you because I hate myself, and you look like your mother who left me. And I'm gonna block out the guilt I feel over mistreating you with the river of vodka. I'm gonna internalize that and unknowingly transfer it onto you tomorrow. Coming reluctantly. Hey, you going to Ray's party? Yeah, I'm going. You know Amy's gonna be there. Yeah, I know. Things have been real good with her, man. Tonight could be the night. Could be. Dude, are you okay? Not really, dude. What's wrong? You're the hottest girl at a party with no parents. You're definitely gonna hit that for sure tonight, man. You're gonna lose that V for good. My penis is white. Excuse me? I have a white penis. What? But you're black. Nuh-uh. I'm biracial. All the white went straight to my penis. But what wait, you mean like like the the color? Oh, wait, hey, dude, I mean, how bad could it be? It's bad. How bad? It's like a Snickers. Regular or fun size? Which one do you get at Halloween? Fun size. That's the one. I know. What am I going to do? I mean, I... How am I going to hit it with Amy with my little white penis? Everyone's going to find out. I'm never, never going to hear the end of it. Dude, dude, Amy's white. She's not going to care. Really? Yeah. <laughs> She's white. Yeah. I guess you're right. She's probably not even gonna know the difference. Ah, oh, man. White girl, white penis. You're all good. Hey, there he is. How'd it go last night? Don't want to talk about it. Well, what happened? Black vagina. The right triangle's longest side is called the hypotenuse. And it's this side here. Hey. You see the longest one. I wish I were high so on potenuse. I wish I was high on potenuse. Oh, Mr. Morris, it's very funny. It's very funny, but let's get back to the lesson. And you can see the longest one where it goes from this point. That was my point. joke. This is one I know, man. That was hilarious. Of a triangle. I've labeled them here A, B, and C. No, but I mean, I said they that. They labeled anything. I said it. You say that they're A, B, I said and it. C. So that I said that. Them. Please, please, Mr. Jackson, keep your comments to yourself. Thank you. Now, the hypotenuse, it... Mr. <laughs> 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 Morrison, you really got me on that one. Oh, oh, so great. Oh, oh, Principal Martell, Principal Martell, come here, come here, come here. 
Uh, tell Principal Martell what you said, Troy. Oh, uh, um, she, she was talking about the hypotenuse, and I said, I wish I was high on potnoose. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> he likes it. <laughs> Principal Martell's cool. Oh, that's, that's very funny. Principal Martell. Principal Martell, I, I said that. Mr. Jackson, that is enough. What I said at first. Oh, uh, Mr. Iglesias. Mr. Iglesias. Yes. Come in, come in. Yeah. Yes. What's up, peoples? Nothing. Comedian Gabriel Iglesias is touring the local schools today for a charity he's working on. Uh, tell him what you said. Tell him what you said. Oh. Uh, I wish I was high on pot noose. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That is clever. That is clever. Very funny. No, very right. funny. <laughs> right? No, no, thanks. Mr. Thanks. Iglesias, Mr. Iglesias, uh, I'm your biggest fan. That was my joke. Uh, you know, it's not really cool, buddy, to take credit for other people's jokes. Hey, listen, funny stuff. I'm doing this big tour right now. You want to see about maybe we could talk about you opening? I need an opener. Oh, uh, um, sure. <laughs> What do you think? Is that okay? Of course. Of yeah. course. Yes. Oh. What? Oh, wow. Sorry about that. Hey, talent, it's man. Nice to Thanks so much. That's like a Richard Pryor. Get over here, man. Oh, come on. Richard Pryor. Uh, he deserved it. All right. So across from the longest side is a 90-degree angle. Good thing I've got a 90-degree dangle. Joel, stop it! You will never be Troy! Why are you trying to be like Troy? Dick. A too nerdy girl. So, the hypotenuse. <laughs> what the f is going on? I'm gonna miss my pants. I'm gonna miss my pants right here. Oh my god. I am your substitute, Mr. Nostrum. But that might as well say no nonsense, because I do not play. Now, today will not be a day off. In fact, today, you will work harder than Totally, let's get our math on, okay? All right, guys, so, um... <laughs> yeah, oh! <laughs> All right, Jerry. Somebody's got a little extra energy for Fizz Ed, right? Yeah. <laughs> Jimmy, buddy. Hey, buddy, let's, okay, it's just, let's knock it off, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> you got me, he got me, right, guys? Jimmy did. All right, let's take our seat. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. That's great. That's great. Very good. Bravo, Jimmy. I'm just kidding. You guys can clap. <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, and I thank you. I, I thank you for the entertainment, man. Jimmy, on, let's go, man. Hey, buddy. I don't want to harsh your vibe, man, but let's go. Ah, Eureka. I'm gonna be honest with you, really pushing my buttons now, Jimmy. <laughs> driving me crazy. Man. <laughs> That's enough. You want me to write your name on the board? <laughs> uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, Jimmy, do you want me to call Principal Mortel? <laughs> that would not be bitching, would it? <laughs> 
You know what, Timmy? You know what? Why don't you come up and teach the class, man? Hmm? Wouldn't that be awesome? What? Yeah, come on up. No, and then you know what I'm gonna do, Jimmy? I'll just sit here. How about that, Jimmy? And then we can all watch how you're being disrupted. Oh, my God. oh I see. That's supposed to be me. Right. All right, Jimmy, okay, I see that. I get it, it's supposed to be me. It's time to be done, Jimmy. Don't you dare, Jimmy. What are you doing? Oh, <laughs> oh, 